Bible by Judith Lang Main. A is for altar. At the Eucharist, we gather around a table called the altar. I will go to the altar of God, to God, my exceeding joy. Psalm 43 4. B is for Bible. The Bible is a sacred book that tells us about God. It is the Word of God. Your Word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Psalm 119.105 C is for Chalice. The chalice is the cup that contains the wine of the Eucharist. After giving thanks, he gave it to them. Mark 14:23. D is for delight. Delight means to be filled with joy, to enjoy completely. When they saw that the star had stopped, they were overwhelmed with joy. Matthew 2:10. For Elizabeth. Elizabeth, Mary's cousin, is the mother of John the Baptist. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the child leaped in her womb. Luke 141. F is for font. The font holds the water for baptism. It is usually made of stone. Create in me a clean heart, O God. Psalm 51:10. G is for Good Shepherd. Jesus is the Good Shepherd who knows and loves each sheep by name. The Good Shepherd calls his own sheep by name and leads them out. John 10:3. is for hidden treasures. Jesus told a story about a treasure hidden in a field. The kingdom of heaven is like treasure hidden in a field. Matthew 13, 44. I is for Isaiah. Isaiah was a great prophet who foretold the birth of the Messiah. People who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Isaiah 9 2. Yay! Is for Jerusalem. Jerusalem is the city in Israel where Jesus offered his life for all people. Jerusalem built as a city. Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. Psalm 122 3 and 6. K is for Kingdom of God. Jesus told many parables or stories about the Kingdom of God. The Kingdom of Heaven is like a mustard seed. Matthew 13:31. L is for Light. Jesus is the light of the world. We are children of the light when we follow him. I am the light of the world, John 8, 12. M is for Mary. Mary is the mother of Jesus. We pray, Hail Mary, full of grace. Mary said, Here am I, the servant of the Lord. Let it be with me according to your word. Luke 1 38. N is for Nazareth. Nazareth is the small town where Mary and Joseph and Jesus lived and worked and prayed. The angel Gabriel was sent by God to a town in Galilee called Nazareth. Luke 1 26. 
oil is for oil. Holy oils are blessed by the bishop and are used in the sacraments of baptism, confirmation, anointing of the sick, and holy orders. You anoint my head with oil. Psalm 23, 5. B is for pearl. Jesus told a parable about a merchant searching for the one most beautiful pearl. The kingdom of heaven is like a merchant in search of fine pearls. Matthew 13, 45. Q is for quiet. When it is quiet, we can be aware that God loves each of us. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. Whoa. Psalm 23, 2 and 3. Oh. Is for resurrection. We celebrate Jesus' resurrection from the dead at Easter. And very early on the first day of the week, when the sun had risen, they went to the tomb. Mark 16, 2. S is for Simeon. Simeon was a holy man who recognized Jesus as God's son. Now there was a man in Jerusalem whose name was Simeon, and the Holy Spirit rested on him. Luke 2.25 D is for Temple. The temple, a place for prayer and worship, was in Jerusalem. We ponder your steadfast love, O God, in the midst of your temple, Psalm 48, 9. You is for understanding. At Pentecost, we ask the Holy Spirit for the gift of understanding. The Spirit of the Lord shall rest on him. The Spirit of wisdom and understanding, Isaiah 11, 2. is for vestment. At the Eucharist, the priest wears a vestment. There are different colors of vestments for the different seasons. On the blue, purple, and crimson yarns, they may finally work vestments for ministering in a holy place. Exodus 39.1 W is for bottle and wine. Sometimes at the Eucharist, the priest pours a few drops of water into the wine. They mingle together. By the mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share the divinity of Christ. X is at the end of Crucifix. The crucifix is a sign of God's love for us. I lay down my life for the sheep. John 10, 15. Why? It's for yeast. Another name for yeast is leaven. It makes bread rise. The kingdom of heaven is like yeast that a woman took and mixed in with the three measures of flour until all of it was leavened. Matthew 13, 33. Yeast is for stands for sleep. Even when we sleep, God is giving us life and love. I lie down and sleep. I wake again, for the Lord sustains me. Psalm 3, 5.